I'm Josh Chaden, and today I'm the face of America. My name is Josh Chaden. I am from New York City, originally from the great state of Iowa. My first relationship with firearms was through hunting. Uh, was through recreational sports in the Midwest. We grew up in a rural community where hunting pheasants, deer hunting was a part of an annual tradition in my family. I personally have only ever shot uh, small shotguns at clay pigeons and uh, have never gone hunting, truly. I've used a BB gun. Uh, but I was called to action after seeing Gays Against Guns rise up in 2016 after the Pulse Massacre in uh, Orlando, Florida. Gays Against Guns is an inclusive organization that supports all people. Uh, we encourage all LGBTQ people and their allies to get involved in the fight to reduce gun violence in America and end the gun violence uh, chain of death in our country. Gun violence disproportionately affects LGBT people in America. 40% of trans youth have actually attempted suicide. 92% of those individuals have actually tried to commit suicide with a gun before they are even able to rent a car legally in America, and that has to stop. I think that the United States is unique in its uh, fascination with guns because we have a revolutionary past. It's written into our constitution that we have the right to bear arms. It has literally been a part of the fabric of our country since its founding. Uh, on top of that, we have a culture that's built upon that fascination and the glamorization of guns in all forms of media, including Hollywood, video games, uh, and just to your basic, um, to your basic Second Amendment rights, to a, a person's interest in hunting. It's just woven through the fabric of the United States of America. Every American citizen has the right to bear arms in our Constitution. I also do believe that it is contingent upon local communities. It's incumbent upon local communities to look to the gun violence epidemic and how it affects their own personal communities. Personally, I do not feel like we should make distinctions between someone's rights in an urban community and a more rural community. Everyone has the same rights in America. We feel like at Gays Against Guns that we should be looking to upgrade background checks through legislation that's currently moving through the House of Representatives and hopefully the Senate. We also believe that local leaders should be encouraging people to practice safer gun laws, to teach their children that even though there is this uh, current gun violence epidemic that they can end it in their own communities. We can end the NRA's stranglehold on our public officials by hitting the streets, by advocating that they end their relationship with elected leaders through their donations. We can shine a light on their uh, practices of pushing the false narrative of the good guy with a gun. We can uh, protest outside their headquarters like we've been doing uh, through direct activism, through our social media efforts, through partnering with other gun violence prevention groups, and getting the word out there that they're phony, essentially. They've been selling the American people and their own membership a false bill of lies, essentially. And it's time to end the NRA. We say at Gays Against Guns that it's time for the NRA to sashay away, and we mean it. Uh, it's time for them to disband. It's time for them to get their dirty money out of our politics. It's time to get their uh, hands out of the pockets of American citizens by uh, looking to them to fund their political action.